Hi, I'm a Stephanie Castro. Today we'll be talking about the red panda. We're going to talk about what the red panda is and why it's going to be extinct and what we should do to make sure it doesn't go extinct. The red panda is one of the species that's on the red list created by the International Union of Conservative Nature. The red panda is a animal that is native to the Himalayas in Asia. The red panda is much larger than a regular cat and it has a bear-like body. And it's named after its fur and it has limbs and its belly is black in color and it has a very long bushy tail. The red panda are tree dwellers and they are harbors in their natural food habitat. The bamboos are considered the red panda's preferred food source. Some of the red pandas still live in India, Nepal, Bhutan, Montar, and China. One of the reasons that the red panda is endangered today is illegal capture and trade. The red panda is captured and killed for many purposes. According to a report by Traffic, the sale of red panda meat is known in southern provinces as China, despite the government's efforts to ban the sale. The animal was haunted for its body parts because it was used for medicines in China. Another reason why the red panda is in danger today is the decreasing amount in the Himalayan bamboo. The red panda is not the only thing that's going extinct. The Himalayan bamboos, also known as the food source for the red panda, is suffering through harsh conditions and yet less bamboos, so less food for the pandas to be fed. Another reason why the red panda is being extinct today is because of naturally low birth rates. When a female red panda is pregnant, her pregnancy lasts for about 112 to 158 days. The litter size is not that big either. It's usually limited to one or two cubs, or sometimes four in some cases. The cubs usually stay with their mother for a year before they leave on their own. They are sexually mature at the age of 18 months. Because of that information, it is known that the red panda has relatively low birth rate, which is making it difficult to conserve its population in the wild. Another reason that the red panda is being extinct today is the natural disasters and climate change that are happening. The natural habitat of the red pandas is vulnerable to a number of natural disasters like landslides, earthquakes, floods, heavy rains, forest fires, weave ends of infestation, etc. Be humans also play a factor in the in the destruction of the habitat. They've been known for illegal construction work on the mountains that caused to have more landslide. Luckily for the red pandas, I have come up with some ideas that might help with their situation. We should raise awareness for the red pandas. We should also sign a petition to the Chinese government to make the capturing of the wildlife species illegal. The humans need to stop building construction on mountains. Studies have said that air pollution plays a factor in climate change. If that is true, we should reduce our car emissions. So that way, climate change is, is the least risk to the natural habitat of the red panda. If you're ever in the Himalayas and you see a red panda, you should not feed it human food or you should feed it plastic because it's a choking hazard. Thank you for watching this environmental conservation video about the Himalayan red panda. At this end of the video, that you should already know what the red panda is and why it's going extinct. Bye. The information in this video is from www.waralice.com.
Also, the images that you saw here in this video are not from me, they're from Google Images.